Hey and welcome back. Just working on the boat. I finally got most of the boat done and ready for the maiden voyage. I'm just working on getting the gas tank, village pump, batteries and motors mounted. So I just, for video purposes, threw the two motors that I got on here, just to show you guys what they look like. I haven't got to painting this motor up yet. I plan on giving this motor a paint job, but it hasn't happened yet, so she's just as is on there. A little rough looking, but Sure, it'll get the job done. And then over here, I got a new trolling motor. I just got off a local classified site. 200 bucks, so not too bad. A little electric motor. It's just something for trolling and backup emergency purposes. In case my motor goes down, I should be able to get to shore. So yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. I just gotta get my batteries in and then I can try it out. Hopefully it's in good working order. I'm sure it will be. I got the stain on the top all the way around. And the doors are on for the cabinets. I'll open one of those up for you so that you see. I got a little latch system on the side here. And then these open that way. They were initially gonna open open like sideways but I, it didn't work the floor wasn't straight enough it was just a nightmare so i put them like this i figured you can open them up throw whatever you need in close it and a little latch and away you go same thing for this side my own quick design out of scraps of wood that i had laying around they're not perfect either but I already got my gas tank in here and I got a tarp strap kind of holding it straight. It could use another one. I might do that yet. And I just put uh, yeah, two little hooks in the side of the wood and a tarp strap over top. So as you can see, those little eye hooks that I put in. See, there you go. More thing, my primer. To prime my motor with gasoline. I'm just in the process of hooking it up right now. So. I got the switch for the village pump all wired up. I'm just about to wire it right here. I'm just going to wire it to the side of the boat with mechanics wire for now. Batteries, I got a marine battery right here that I'm going to use for running the trolling motor and whatnot. And then I got just an old car battery I'm going to use just for the billage pump. So that way the billage pump always has power, hopefully. So that's my plan there. I got my vent line ran up over here away from... I didn't want the tank venting under the floor with the batteries in there could be dangerous so I got the vent up over there. Maiden voyage is close. It's either going to be maiden voyage or I'm going to be dead from working on this boat. So, Hey folks, the boat is what I call ready for the maiden voyage. I am tired but the boat's done so that's what's important. There's a few odds and ends I need to do like there's things that aren't quite right and that cover door needs to be trimmed. The light on the bow isn't hooked up to any sort of wiring. The vent for the fuel tank is disconnected because it hits on the floor. I need a different fitting so it uh, can come out in the 90 and not hit. So there's a few things that are definitely going to be a few days of tinkering around to get things perfect, but I feel confident that the boat could be launched right now. And checked for leaks and flotation and the motor working good and blah 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 i feel comfortable taking the boat out right now the way it is for its maiden voyage so i think maybe we'll do that as soon as everybody's available and uh, feeling well enough tow her down to the river or something and put her in see how she looks in the water it's probably going to be issues i would imagine like anything new there's always odds and ends that'll need straightening out but I'm sure we'll be able to get to the bottom of them. Thanks for following along all this time with the uh, boat restoration videos. Appreciate all you guys tuning in for this restoration. As I do little upgrades and whatnot to the boat I'll keep you guys posted. I'm going to paint the engine and wire that bow light, trim that door, Maybe get a couple more seats for other people to sit on. Maybe not. I might put in that. Well, I'm getting, I'm getting a top for sure, a convertible top. I just got to order one. Still got to order the decal for the side of the boat for the name. And then I got to get the registration, register the boat, and get a registration number put on it. 
So there's going to be a few things I'll have to do yet, but I think we can take her down and see how she floats.